Yes, guys, you heard right. Spa is finally in a good and popular game. Finally, a game of this magnitude decided to add a track of this magnitude. And it's fully custom made. So, yeah. As you can see, we have uh, all the famous corners. We have La Source leading up to Eau Rouge and Radillion. Then we have this back section leading to this downhill section down into Puhon. Then we have the very high speed corners which lead us to the back straight. And this is where the epic overtake of Max Verstappen was done around the outside back in 2015. And that all leads us to this very final bus stop chicane which leads us to the finish line. Obviously a job very well done, but I want to see how bumpy that section is especially. But before that, what is this? So it has my name on it. Yes, it is my own car, ladies and gentlemen. Finally, I have my own livery in a major row racing game. Red Bull, Row Arthur, Red Bull Racing. I don't know what it's called actually. Uh, so, I mean, Row Arthur, Red Bull Arco, I don't know. You guys decide for me what my team should be called. So, um, before we go out on track, this is a cool little feature. Uh, we have a pit crew in the game. Uh, looks like they broke my car. Guys, you're supposed to fix my car, not break it. What is this? This is a joke. This is a yoke. Oh, they fixed it. Did they fix it? Pit crew, did you finally do your job? Let's see. Oh, they fixed it. There you go. That's my pit crew, guys. You should get yourself a pit crew that good as well. Anyways, though, let's go ahead and move on. Up Eau Rouge for the first time. And that's actually not too bad at all. If you get a good line through there, I'm not sure that the bumps can even affect you. But I want to go ahead and check out what the lap time we have to beat is. So I'm going to click on the laps and uh, hopefully the UI appears. There you go. Uh, it's blank. Oh, there you go. Okay. So, this is the Spa Time Trial leaderboard. Obviously, I will not be able to beat the first time because it's set by Chris Boye. He's an absolute tryhard. As you can see, he's miles quicker than second position. But I do at least want to get into the top 20. And the lap time we have to beat is a 121.8. So, let's go ahead and let's sweat it out through Puhon we go for the first time. I don't know if it's going to be flat out. We are going to find out together. This is my first time playing uh, Spa on RFA. So we will be doing the discovery together. Anyways, we move to the back straight. We are closer than ever to starting our first lap. What was that bump? Hopefully that does not happen in our main lap. But hey, it also doesn't affect the car as much as you think. We don't lose that much performance. Anyways. Uh, through the bus stop chicane, this is the final corner of Spa. Uh, let me go ahead and put myself into the rich mixture and deploy ERS through into turn one. Hey, we don't mess it up. That's a change. That's a change. That's a really, really good change, actually, from my usual um, hot lapping stuff. Anyways, up through a rouge, fully flat out. Um, as you can see, yep, the bumps can not affect you. What is that cursed time of sector one? Look at that. 16.666. That is cursed. But, uh, okay. Through these corners, I bottom out on that curb. And we do actually hit that wall, which is very, very unfortunate. But it's fine. We have all the time in the world to set a top 20 lap time. Uh, but before we start our next lap, I also want to see if I can do Puhon flat out. Let me deploy ERS. Can we do it? Uh, we got the track, but we don't invalidate. So I guess it's entirely possible. Great. I'm going to use that knowledge on my next lap. Oh, but before I forget, uh, they added this rewards button, right? As you can see, there's this spirit type of thingy in the middle of the screen. With this you will be able to get uh, Zach's, I guess, uh, car this week and my car next week. Or, uh, Moon Oli told me that he is going to get me an exclusive code that if you guys put in here and redeem, you will get the cars yourselves for free. So, I will have that code as soon as possible. So, do join my Discord server if you want to claim this car for yourself. But without further ado... Let's go ahead and start our second lap time through the bus stop chicane. Let's make sure we get a good exit out of the last turn. We start our first, uh, well, second lap, actually. Uh, we do way, way worse into one, but that is fine. I just want to set myself a lap time to compare um, and see how far down we are. Through a Rouge again, 
uh, fully flat out. This time around we are a couple of tenths slower into sector 1, but that was expected. We kind of actually failed <laughs> miserably into 1, but that is fine. We don't bottom out on the curb this time around, and now we go downhill. I want to break at the beginning of that curb, and that works quite perfectly. And I am incredibly, incredibly happy with my second lap so far. I did not expect that I would be doing so good, but... oh. Okay, we run wide, but we don't invalidate. That's actually great news. Okay, high speed corners now. Let's make sure we don't bottom out on those as well. Second sector was quicker, which is uh, actually to be expected because I did slow down into sector two. And now sector three, this is the back straight right before the finish line. Our tires are pretty much done by now. That is fine, we move on. I will break a little bit before the actual bus stop chicane because if I break uh, that late I think we're gonna lock up go straight on but we end the lap that bunker lap is a 122.5 and we need a 121.8 so there's still quite a little bit of time that we need to find but I do think it is possible and I will give you just one thing uh, that we all can relate to I said a better sector 2 on my out lap than my actual lap itself anyway uh, I will be jumping in and out of the car I think that resets your tire wear yeah there you go so we don't have to go back in the pits and then do another lap which obviously saves us quite a lot of time but uh, we move on um, also if you guys are wondering this is a private server meaning I did disable the timer so the track won't change unless I forcibly change it so that's just a little bit more helpful into setting a better time uh let me make sure i'm back into rich let's deploy our ers through uh turn one and as we absolutely miserably fail turn one um hopefully we can make up the rest of the time through the rest of the lap but we will have to see about that through a rouge uh, i don't know if you guys think that's radion but for me it's obviously a rouge hey sector one wasn't that bad it was uh, a tenth of our first lap which wasn't too bad either so that's just great news i did not expect that anyways we move on we absolutely nail that section to be honest now downhill make sure we don't run wide uh, we do a little bit but okay with that did not sacrifice too much speed uh of our speedometer there uh fully flat out through puhan again okay that's great news uh f1 cars usually shift down into seven through there but this is RFA. We have the absolute OP grip around here. Uh, 36.1 was sector 2. So I guess that's a good improvement. Uh, into the back straight now. We are deploying all the ERS in the world. Uh, making sure we have that top speed for this back straight. And uh, let's see what kind of lap time this lap produces. We're going to break at for the bus stop chicane. And uh, into the exit of the corner. We deploy our ERS again. What is it going to be? A 121.7. Are we in? 121.7. What? Why are? Oh, there we are. Great. P15, guys. We did it. What is this? The third lap. Where did my skill issue go? Look at that. Anyways, though, uh, that was Spa in RFA. Uh, you guys can try it. It's out now. About my car, as I said, Moon Audi will give me my code uh, next week, I suppose, which I can give you all. So do join my Discord server to find out about that code. Anyways, though, I will be leaving you guys with this epic shot of Aero Rouge into Roblox. I actually can't believe that we have another Spa in Roblox. Um, and it's actually quite smooth. Like, uh, look at that. You can't see the difference uh between <laughs> real life actually no i'm not gonna go ahead and say that we're not at that stage yet but uh it's definitely quite okay i did not have high expectations since uh it's entirely custom made and uh, i guess what i'm saying is that they did a good job and you guys should definitely try it but until my very next video guys do stay safe and bye bye